many clips many clips see that one two three four four clips Hello, today I was searching for some specific position from the tank destroyer battalion which um, was here somewhere on this hill and I finally found something so um, at first uh, the US dug some big holes to put the tank in and to protect the world which is just there and uh, yeah I have something here my first big signals and uh, actually there's a few ammo so there's more in the holes but uh, yeah that's difficult to take them because they are in the mud so US ammunition for M1 Garant or yeah basic basic caliber so yeah I will show you if I find something interesting in this hole but I think so because the the, the signal was quite big so so that's it this is a lot of ammunition and you can see that they were wrapped into uh, paper there's some little remain here but it's so muddy and so difficult to dig but there is yeah, a ton of them everywhere in the hole I have also a little uh, coffee bag yeah so uh, I catch a few bullets they are stuck together and look what I just saw 20 cartridges armor piercing bullets I hope because uh, yeah there's some black tips so you can't see that because of the paper but yeah that's that's some black tips uh, caliber 30 ammunition Remington arms and yeah must be made as pre I don't know I will try to to have the full one because there's some more in the hole and I think this is only the half of the paper I, I catch so yeah would be nice if I have it completely that's really really cool the second part of paper which is really nice but uh, I can't continue now it's getting dark as you can see but there's a lot more ammo definitely a lot more okay you you can definitely not see anything but uh yeah i have to go i will try to come back tomorrow or uh, the next days and we'll show you but i think there is maybe two or three times more ammunition there's maybe 200 here and uh yeah there's more in the hole many m1 clips but they are all broken uh, this one still have the piper i ruined it it's quite quite cool uh, yeah, but just a bit sad that yeah, they are in a very bad condition, uh, almost all broken like this. So yeah, I will just fight back the hole and we'll come back. So yesterday I was back in the hole where I found uh, many emission, many US emission, uh, but it was really dark to to film. So I do this today. This is what I found yesterday. So the hole is really bigger. You can see that I found a US gas mask here, uh, a rifle grenade, bayonet scabbard for the M1 Garand bayonet. 
and the US Mastin and there is many things everywhere so there were a few ammo here, uh, many M1 clips and uh, there is some remain of a US raincoat so I just cleaned them already you can see the Mastin is an Inox so in a really good shape the bayonet scabbard as well with a marking on it with black paint it says serve I don't know if this is a name or something else or in itself uh, the grenade is full so still dangerous I will not take it and the gas mask is still with the cartridge it's in rubber so it was in a quite bad shape, that's strange because uh, the paper with uh, the ammo was in a really good condition so yeah I don't know why it is in a uh, uh, yeah, really bad shape. You can still see the cartridges and the, the tube is gone. Oh uh, yeah, so that's a US gas mask. I found uh, this fork also, US fork, but it's in I1 and it's falling apart that's all for the moment I will show you if I find something else so here we have more relics many M1 clips as you can see one here, a second one, a third one uh, there's many food box and uh, pieces of cigarette paper and uh, yeah coffee and stuff like that there's some more uh, I1 here I don't know what it is for the moment so, one clip. Second one. They are not in a good shape, but that's still M1 clip. The other one are stuck, so I will have to dig more. What is this? Oh, that's a pin from a, a grenade. As you can see, yeah, that's the pin with the handle for a grenade MK2. And yeah, as you can see, there's some stuff everywhere. Also, the grenade is here. So, yeah, I will have to dig carefully. So, we have a really big part of the US raincoat and many stuff under it. So, for the moment, we just uh, uh, open in, on the side and uh, we will try to not break it. Uh, here we have a US shovel, so this is just uh, the handle and it's still some uh, wood inside So that's the same shovel that I have uh, here So we have the part exactly here for the moment and this thing is falling apart as you can see So yeah, we'll take that together and we will show you This is the moment to take out the US shovel US for the bell shovel, yeah. This one is in a quite good condition. Uh, so as you can see, it is exactly the same as mine. So you can see better uh, now the raincoat, and there is a uh, something in inox here. I think that's uh, it's the mestin, dress mestin. So we we'll see what we have under that. There's a big signal, so I think there's many things. Um, so, let's see. Russian. There's some wood. Yeah. I feel many things. Oh, oh, oh. we have something here. It's like a shovel, maybe? A German shovel? I have no idea. Okay, it's moving. Oh, that's another US shovel. Yeah. Foldable shovel. Cool. So, what else? I have something here too. 
Oh, it's another shovel. The third in this hole. And there is some M1 clip. Ooh. Many clips. Many clips. See that? One, two, three, four. Four clips. So. One, two, three, four. This is probably more. You can still see the, the handle from the shovel. The wood handle. It's like almost complete, so I will try to not break it. Four clips. Okay. Some, one, it will be difficult to keep complete the handle, but I will try to do that. Yeah. Okay, maybe a grenade. Yeah, that's it. That's another grenade, there is one here, one here, one here, and uh, we already dug out one. Okay, so that's it. Another shovel. Third in this hole. You can see them here. One, two, three, shower. Okay. So this is the handle from the shower. It's falling apart. But that's still wood after uh, all those years, almost uh, 75 years ago. Okay, there is some more clips. Um. Uh -huh. Two clips with some women of uh, Cardboard or paper or wind them. Some ration. Some more clips. Again and again. And we have something here which is different. Okay, that's a grenade. So, don't touch at this, this is really dangerous, so we will uh, keep that safe and uh, send a uh, call uh, the authorities. Okay. So there is the second one here, we have a little clip. So many stuff here. So many stuff. Okay. This one has some black tips that mean a uh, piercing bullet. So maybe to shut the vehicle uh, on the road. Okay, that's, that's a pin, I think, from the grenade. Looks like that. Not sure about that. Um, yeah, you can see it here. Yeah.
Okay, it's moving. You can see there is some uh, green paint and yellow paint on the top. That means uh, high explosive grenade. Okay, so I think uh, I will stop a moment, try to just uh, remove the dirt and uh, we will open on that side. Uh, yeah, there's some more things everywhere. So I expect, uh, yeah, maybe a, a helmet in this hole, why not? So my buddy just found that and this is actually the chain of a US dog tag. So uh, we really hope that uh, the dog tag is still in the hole. Uh, yeah, that's a very cool find, personal item. That's uh, the best find. So it became uh, quite big, as you can see. And we are in the middle of the field. So I think there's some more fox soil everywhere. Um, you can see tons of ammo, M1 clips. The showers, so happy to see all this stuff. This hole is full of stuff. And we try to get out the mess tin No, It's already moving. There's some more stuff. Yeah, it's coming. This is the top part. And in inox, so brand new. You can eat in it. Yeah, there's a attachment. Maybe some marking. Okay. Cool. So that's yeah the top lid from the machine. We have the two parts now. Maybe we can uh, expect the canteen and the canteen cup. We see that there's some little stuff in R1 in it. No, I have no idea what this is. So there it is, the US jacket. Uh, you can see it's quite big. I'll try to show you that. I just here. removed some dirt with the cut. It was just under the raincoat, and you can see that there is some stainless again. That's another machine for me. Yes, yes, that's so cool. We have some more things, I think. Uh, here, yeah, that's a toothbrush. US toothbrush. Nice. US Army, maybe, written on it. Oh, that's something else, but it's USA, I think. Yeah. Try to brush it against my pants. Uh, yeah, made in USA. So that's, yeah, that's a cool find. And there is some a tube, shaving cream tube, Barbasol. Um, it's complete, a good commission. The first in this hole. That's, yeah, it's quite cool. So, what else? Uh, some wood. Oh, we have something here. And I think, not sure about that, but there is, uh, oh, I don't know the right for, word for this, but uh, we have something to. Uh, repair your uh, paint when you have a hole in it uh, I mean I don't know the white right word for this I will uh, check it and, and show you but you can open it like this and there is some things inside uh, but I will show you okay so maybe okay another tube maybe this is the content of a bag with all the personal item, you can uh, expect maybe a weather or something like that. I try to dig it carefully because there's probably some little stuff in it, little button and stuff like that. 
Okay, I feel something here. Yeah, there's something here. Another food box, maybe. Yeah, okay. Okay. Another M1 clip. Get it with now. The first the clip. One more, one more. Okay. Wow. As new as the other one. Mortar shell came in and wounded several men right close around me. There was one man that was almost in arm's reach of me, and I could see that he was hit badly. Was, uh, the back of his head uh, practically bone off, and he was in a state of shock. I tried to comfort the man, prop his head up until the medic could reach him. And all this time, and I shall never forget this, this man was trying to apologize for me for being hit and sorry, almost crying, because he would not get to carry on with the battalion and continue the fight. And uh, of course, we fight back the hole. So as you can see, it's almost like uh, it was before. And uh, yeah, it's the end for this Vauxhall. There's nothing else, only a few ammunition. And ooh, we have a cardboard full of relics. And uh, I just tried with the detector to see if I had some more signals and uh, actually I have many of them here and behind me on the other side so I think uh, the folks were uh, all along this line. <laughs>